See, umpiring is a real challenge, you know. Mm, every day a new thing comes up, a new kind of a, a decision will come up. Uh, every game is unique. We need to keep learning and we need to keep improving all the time. We also make mistakes in the bargain, but you know, take the learnings and make sure that the mistakes don't uh, uh, repeat. That's it. That's the great, uh, great challenge of umpiring. It depends on what kind of a series I'm going to go into. You know, the first is the format of the game, whether it is a T20 or a ODA or a, a Test match. Then I go through all the um, uh, playing conditions for that particular format. Then I make a, a thorough study of the teams, do a lot of homework about both the teams. Um, if I'm going in the middle of the series, I talk to my colleagues who have done um, uh, the previous or earlier games, uh, get as much information as possible about the teams, the players, the captains, the coaches, the support staff, the weather and the pitches if possible. Then we have a lot of resources like uh, Sky, uh, OneDrive and um, uh, the uh, ICC uh, Net where we can um, uh, go through all the videos uh, which have been uploaded. So we go through the videos and um, uh, make uh, some mental uh, notes. Then once we get to the venue, we try to stand in the nets prior to the game, get used to the conditions, get used to the players. So um, then we have a chat with uh, the PCT, um, get, to, um, get to know each other better and uh, plan for a particular series or a game. The message is, uh, you know, you need to work hard and be patient. Um, keep working hard, be patient. You will reach uh, the top. If, if you have the uh, uh, skills of an international umpire, you need to be um, patient and keep working hard.